Hi guys, Dave here from Wolf in the Wilds. I got something for you that I've been wanting to do for a while, haven't really gotten around to doing it. Today we're gonna, you'll have to pardon all the noise. I'm literally right next to the road on my way into the woods to shoot video. And I saw this opportunity, had to take it. Now this patch of green that you see here, these are wild leeks. They are not actually ready to be harvested yet. Uh, the leaves are perfectly edible. You can cook them into soups or meats or whatever. You could eat them raw, you can put them in salads. They're perfectly fine, but the bulbs are not yet ready. So we're gonna more or less leave these as they are right now. Um, but pretty much right in the middle, there are trout lilies in here. And trout lily are toxic. So it is a good idea to know exactly what you're dealing with. Okay. Try to get this tripod to... All right, this right here is trout lily. There's a leaf here, there's a leaf here. So there's a, there's a couple of them growing right in the center of this patch. Now these are perfectly fine. These uniform green ones, perfectly fine. These mottled ones, two-tone greens, those are toxic. They'll give you one heck of a stomach ache, diarrhea, um, all kinds of nastiness. Um, and they'll burn, actually. They'll, they'll make your throat and tongue burn and all that good stuff. Not good at all. Um, <clears throat> so you, you really got to know what you're doing when you're foraging for stuff like this to avoid that kind of discomfort. There's a whole bunch of them growing here, actually. So... Now... The best way, the absolute best way to tell if you're dealing with anything in like the onion family or the garlic family is you just pull a piece of the leaf off, give it a little bit of a crush and then smell it. And if that smells like onion or garlic, then it is onion or garlic. Nothing else in the woods will smell like that. So these trout lilies do not have that smell, not at all. So there you have it, a on-the-spot comparison between perfectly edible wild leeks and semi-toxic, bad-for-you trout lilies. Thanks for watching. Have a good one, guys. We'll see you in the next video.